Hey friends, Mike and Jess here. And welcome to Regeneration Nation TV. Today we are reacting to Robbie Williams. This is Come Undone. Another live at Nebworth in 2003 this time. Yeah, so same venue, different year. Yeah. But uh, yeah, from looking at the thumbnail, I wasn't sure, but you just confirmed it. Yeah, he's a different year. I actually he looks didn't different, realize that. Even. Jess picks up on more things than I do. But yeah, the first one was so good <laughs> and had such a great reception. And there were a few recommendations where we should go to next. So it was kind of hard to choose, but we're here. We've got a few other ones that we're going to get to as well. So definitely hit that subscribe button if, if this is your first time here, because we will do be doing some more. Yeah, I'm excited for these because I was vaguely familiar with Robbie, but not like this and especially not live. But yeah, I'm really excited to go down this journey for sure. Yep. So uh, yeah, we'll have links below in the description, the pinned comment for Angels. You can go check that one out if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, without further ado, we also have links for this official video. And I can't remember if I found a channel for Robbie Williams or not, but if we can, it will be down below as well. Go support him directly. And without further ado, let's get into this. Let's do it. This is Come Undone. Oh, I like the tie. <laughs> the crowd is, dude, that's a, a couple. Uh, sorry for pausing so quickly, but we got a lot of comments about the crowds at Nedworth <laughs> and how big they are and how crazy they are. And I've only been to a concert, but these like festivals like this mm -hmm. just look so crazy. Yeah. The crowds look so, so many people. Yeah, it's so many people, man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what? So unimpressed, but so in awe. Such a saint, such a whore. Thank you. <laughs> so self aware, so full of shit. So indecisive, so adamant. I'm contemplating, thinking about thinking. It's so overrated, just get another drink in. Watch me come on down. Yes, I'm raising gates, I'm here in the street. I pray for when I'm coming down, you'll be asleep. If I ever hurt you, your revenge will be so sweet because I'm scarred. Prison, I'm your son. Dude, this is a uh, already it's like speaking to all of us man. speaking to the human experience yeah uh, i love the lyrics so far mm -hmm. man that's uh that's something that we don't really have here is when you're from like we're from jacksonville florida you're from knoxville i think you guys have it more whenever you meet somebody at least from what i've experienced and they find out that you're from knoxville as well there's like this camaraderie yeah um which i have not felt growing up very much yeah but I love that. I love seeing that. You know, I feel like you guys over there are just such a tight knit group. Whenever, mm -hmm. like, you got each other's back. Man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And him saying that right there, Britain. There's I a genuineness to it. And yeah. I feel like every person that we've come into contact from the UK is very just upfront and blunt. And there's such a genuine, like, thing that can happen from knowing somebody like that is just like you know everything they're saying is 100 percent true they're not hiding any of their feelings and it's just it allows you to be more free and open i feel like that's a more beneficial relationship which yeah. is beautiful will be so sweet because i'm scarred prison i'm your son I love the die. <laughs> it's such a look. Oh no way! Oh wow. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. How cool. Thanks. <laughs> so in a train, so animal. <laughs> so 
Hey yo, shoot your shot, girl. It's only fair. It's only fair. You went you went for his booty. Wow. He's like, losing their minds. This is so much. Hold on. We have to skip back for this whole thing, dude. I feel like we're laughing and talking so much. This you is have to amazing. see it again. Thanks. <laughs> so a train, so animal. <laughs> so need your love. <laughs> never, never have I seen that. Happen before ever. <laughs> this oh is incredible. My gosh, this dude, is that, so incredible. What a freaking moment <laughs> this is, dude. This, oh. this is a random girl he just pulled up and this is happening with. Yeah. This is crazy. He is a gangster. <laughs> He's is, like, well, we've already caught yeah, the feeling. I mean, we're, we're, we're literally. Well make out. She literally pulled back and she's like please kiss me yeah please please you can tell the way she's looking at him she wants oh it. she's living the fantasy of freaking 99 percent of the audience i guarantee it oh my god wow <laughs> she's trying to get the eye contact dude. oh my god i just don't want to if i stop lying i just be so <laughs> This is, I can't. That was so. This is so intimate. I feel like you shouldn't be watching. <laughs> if I ever hurt you, your revenge will be so sweet because I'm strong. This is insane. <laughs> oh my. That is awesome. Ah, yeah, girl. <laughs> I'm so happy for her. <laughs> what an experience. That fire in the background is so cool. Yeah, it looks weird. <laughs> I absolutely love him. I do. I love all my sad songs. I love all my sad songs. I love all my sad songs today. What a video. That was what awesome. What a freaking video, man. That's crazy. I absolutely adore looking at his face when he's performing. I love looking at everything that he does. It's 
his bright eyes and his adoration for everyone that's in the audience. It's yeah. like almost like he's been per- performing for years and years, but he never gets over that energy and that excitement of people that adore him. And he just takes it all in. And I just love watching him perform. That was so crazy. Like, I don't know. His eyes are just to kill for. Like, I can't. I if can't the girl that got pulled up on stage watches this, you got you to gotta comment on the For world. real. Let How us know what you that? were feeling, oh, what it's like you're years taking that. after. Like, oh, is that it's the best memory years. of your life? That's 20 years ago. 20 years yeah. ago. And you're still holding on to that memory. I guarantee you, you are like like it was yesterday. I would still hold on to that. That's so what a incredible. Crazy thing, man. Yeah, that would never happen today. Never. Getting pulled up. I see videos of like people coming up on stage mm-hmm. with their favorite artist or whatever yeah. at a sh- at a live show, but I've never seen anything. Never like, like that. that. First of all, he didn't have security just bombarding the stage like it would happen today. It was such an intimate moment for you, you and him. I'm still talking to that girl because I know you're she'll be watching. Dancing, but you're literally feel on yeah each other. it just like it was just the two of you like how amazing was that like that is incredible like she pulled out and was like please make eye contact yeah please kiss me. yeah and then he did oh it was magical like, it was a magical wow. moment we watched that it. was very intimate that was, man. that was very intimate yeah definitely i just like wow. i felt like i should look away but i couldn't i couldn't look away <laughs> i was like i kept looking i was like this is so exciting <laughs> and then seeing her in the audience she's still like Oh my gosh, like I that bet you she wasn't happened. even listening to anything that was going on. It was just like tunnel vision. Like she's still like, oh my gosh, what I just happened? I feel like if that happened today, there would be interviews with her all over the oh, place. Oh yeah, yeah. So I wonder if there were, because it wasn't that long ago. No, not at all. There'd um, still be, yeah. I wonder if there's any interviews out there with her. Yeah, I do want to see it. Just to see like her reaction, just talking, like yeah. saying everything that was going through her head. Like I'm reeling that from crazy. that for her. So that's so crazy. But he is um i was gonna make a point and i'm still thinking about how amazing that would be as an experience like oh this song in in general like this song is like you're just still imagining what it'd be like to be in her shoes huh? <laughs> i have no idea what you're talking about i'm, I'm just not sitting over here like i'm not imagining I, at all I, I, I need to really step up my game <laughs> no but this song is like basically just accepting every part of you and i feel like it's such a an awesome amazing like i would definitely be singing this song with a hairbrush in the mirror looking at myself <laughs> you know because you have those yeah. moments where you look at yourself and you're just thinking about all the horrible things about you the things that you hate and then you're just like oh well that's me like you've, we've all gotten to that point where we're like f it like i am who i am and this is like the ultimate song of that like he's saying all these horrible things about him but he's also saying all these good things about him and even um they're selling razor blades and mirrors on the street i feel like that was just totally like all in one sentence saying everything that he's saying in the song like they're giving you something to hurt yourself with, but they're also giving you that mirror to stare at yourself while you're doing it. You know what I mean? Like they're also giving you both things. Like look at yourself in the mirror, see all the things that you hate about yourself, and then here's something to take care of that. You know what I mean? Like it's just the ultimate, like love yourself no matter what song. That's what it gave me vibes of. Like just he's singing about all these things that he could possibly hate himself and go down this horrible road, but he's celebrating it. And I just feel like that's an ultimate like, love yourself no matter what song and then he's just like i love all my sad songs and it's just like i don't know the ultimate love song i feel like for yourself and yeah. just i really did like it a lot i never heard that song before but i really mm-hmm. liked it well said i think you encapsulated <laughs> it perfectly but yeah was, i like uh, him that a was lot. good song mm-hmm. great crowd energy once again but yeah. man that moment right there that's like what makes this video it for does. me it does it's so incredible crazy, crazy yeah. moment never seen anything like that before ever i don't yeah. i cannot say that i've seen anything like that that was yep. super cool <laughs> that would go viral if it happened absolutely today live show yeah so, that was great that was great we need to yeah I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. That was just, uh, that Spread was that to all your friends. Make sure she sees that. We want to hear about this lady. Where is this young lady right now? Right. What is she doing with Somebody her life? Somebody could cut that up into a YouTube short or a TikTok and like the craziest thing to happen at a live show ever. Yeah. And it would it would pop off. I'm sure that it probably has. Yeah, it probably has. I'm surprised I've never and seen it. And there's probably that. more moments like that that I just haven't seen. I'm, I'm yeah. sure you guys know like, oh, well, you haven't seen that. Look at this live show. This happened at this live show, you know. Because <laughs> yeah, those get recommended to me all the time. Mm-hmm. Just random fans coming up and singing with the person. Yeah. 
playing guitar those, but with him or whatever it is. Mm-mm. There's something different about that one. That one's just a super intimate moment. Like, Crazy. I feel like we shouldn't have been a part of, but we were. And it was, like, super natural. Like, there was nothing interfering with it. It was not anything super crazy. She wasn't, like, super, like trying to rip his clothes off or anything like that. You know what I mean? It didn't seem like she was a fanatical person. It just seemed like very natural. Like he spotted her in a bar or something and they just naturally had chemistry. I thought that was nice about that too. Cause you, you see those moments where it's like that super fanatical fan. I'm going to be disappointed if we find out in the comments after that, that's actually his girlfriend or something. I'm not going to be disappointed. That was super romantic. I want it to be more natural. Like what you're saying. Like I want it to just be a random fan that happened with, I don't know why. (laughs) To make it for that much more of a crazy. Room, but my nose starts running every sniffles. time. All right, y'all. Well, thank you for recommending that one. That was absolutely amazing. Yeah, that was such a fun watch for more sure. More Robbie to come. Yes. And uh, yeah, we'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, friends. Peace. I'm not scared of your love. Show me your love.